What's up friends and antagonists both minor and major, I'm Essel, and welcome to a survival game. I am kind of, I don't know, I'm excited. I played Subnautica like two years ago, I think, last 2016, 2015, a long time ago. And when I played it, I was more into this genre, but I knew that I wanted to wait for launch. And after many years, it's launched. So let's give it a look. Let's see how it goes. And yeah, 2015, look at that. Dang. Wow. Over two years. Wow. So the reason why I'm excited about this game is that there's a there's a narrative. We have narrative and story and stuff happening. So I'm excited to uncover that and see how this goes from here. So let's give it a look and uh, see what happens. We'll start off with the survival. I think hardcore is too much. This is not going to be as good as Rebel. Well, so let's do default mode, default settings. We'll learn this, see what's up. I'm moving into this as blind as possible. I have never... I've seen nothing. I've seen, I think, 10 minutes of the opening. That's really about it. So I'm excited to see what happens and looking forward to this. This is a little bit off on my usual beaten path. And this genre is such a huge phenomenon these days so i'm excited to see what it's like to play a finished survival game because most of the survival games that i've ever seen or played are games that are not done to some degree this one is done now there could be future updates but this game is this game is done so congrats to unknown worlds and let's see how this goes A cutscene. Yeah, I have no control yet. Audio design is pretty solid so far. Okay. All right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Yo, that was tense. Sorry for the profanity so soon, but I was not expecting that. The concussion. Oh god. Can we Okay, can we uh fire extinguisher? No? This is right, it's right, it's right on the floor. Oh hi, can we do this? Uh yep. Uh how do we use it? Right click. Excellent. Yay! It's working. Oh. Uh okay. Really? Oh, that's funny, okay. That's funny. I thought it was part of the game. <laughs> I was like, okay, sure. I can give some feedback. It is part of the game, but I mean, like, part of the, uh, like, the on-screen narrative. You have suffered minor yeah. head trauma. This is considered a optimal <laughs> outcome. All things considered, I guess so. It has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive. To keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Oh god. Okay, so we have this. So the PDA log is going to be kept here in our menu. We have an extinguisher. Nice. And it has fuel. That's good to know. Oops. Tab, sorry. Use fabricator. Okay. Nice. They're helping us out. They're helping us out. First aid kit. Get. Fabricator. Okay. Oh, hey. Materials, so there's like a lot of stuff. We'll, we'll ignore that for now. We'll, let's just get out of here, I think. Oh, uh, storage we have flares. These seem pretty good to keep. Uh, let's, let's grab the flares. Water seems good as well. And nutrient blocks also seems good. Well, let's let's carry this stuff, sorry. I'll get used to the uh, tab versus escape thing in a sec. Use repair tool. We don't have one of those yet, I don't think. Let's, so let's get up top side and hopefully we'll find a repair tool in the, in the uh, wreckage. Whoa. Dang. Okay. It's gorgeous. The water is rendered beautifully. I mean, I'd hope so. It's like it's okay about water, but like, you know what I mean? Okay. Let's... Wow. I'm going to assume that's the Aurora, and we gotta get over there, right? Achievement unlocked. Getting your feet wet. Oh, the little baby manta rays are so cute. Can I have one? No? Okay, that's fine. Understandable. Oh my goodness, this is looking so good. Frame rate's pretty smooth. 
I mean, considering the amount of rendering that's going on, this is, I'm pretty impressed, honestly. Ooh, break limestone. Can we do that? Hey, copper ore. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Okay. Your probability of survival has just increased. So there's like chunks on stuff, I guess. Can we take the small boy here? No? Okay, I guess not. Oh, 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 shit, right. We have low oxygen levels so, so, so far. I'm sure we're going to get, like, more ways to oxygen later. But for right now, that's all we got. We're a little low on hunger, so we can we can chomp down on one of those nutrient blocks soon. Oh, hi. Oh, it's just algae. Or, whoa, is it like a whole four? Oh, yeah, what is this? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We have, we have wreckage. We have wreckage. Let's take a look. Ooh, it's a uh, power glove. Feel the power in your hands. Cargo. It seems to be just plants now, so that's good. We have, uh, the surface is close. We'll be okay. This may not be anything, actually, but let's take a look, though. Can we take the bacon fragment? I know it's a beacon, but it's... Oh, hey, this is copper, right? Titanium! Did we get... Oh, shit. Oh, God. That is extremely stressful. Which I remember being, like, the main thing that was interesting about the game in the first place, was that it was just so stressful. Um, but in a way that's engaging, right? That's, that's, that's what's cool about survival games. Like, you play them to, to, to be a little bit stressed. Because, like, having to eat and consume water and that kind of thing is a stressful experience. I would say. Ooh, this is from, like... Oh, it's a little... It's a peeper! Oh, it's so cute. Oh, we gotta get up top. Can we swim faster with shift? I think so. So if I if I remember correctly, oops, can we uh, go back above water? There we go. Oh, okay. So if we like angle upwards, it like shoots us out like a dolphin. But if we don't, it'll we can stay above water. Um, the aurora here, if I remember correctly, is like very irradiated. We're getting closer, right? Yeah. Okay. And is not good to be near. But maybe that was just a, a thing from the beta. And now that it's, like, launched, we can actually go closer and explore the wreckage. We are getting closer. Yes. Just just slowly. This is a big... Oh, God. This is a big place. I'm surprised you can swim this far out. How large is the map, then? Oh, yep. All right, bye. <laughs> I'm going to take that as a, as, as a no-go. Yeah, we got to get back to the pod, though, because I don't want to be too far away from the pod. It sounds scary so far. Like, I, I know there's oxygen tubes and stuff like that that we're going to want to have. Let's see. I think the wreckage is probably important, though, right? Grab trap fragments. We can't. We don't seem to be able to collect it. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, holy shit. Holy shit. No. Oh, they detonated. Are you kidding? Yes, oxygen. Same. Um, like I said, the sound design's really good. I am impressed so far. Uh, where is the ship? There it is. Okay, good. I feel safer now. Wow, I mean, it's gorgeous, though. They've done a great job with the lighting effects. Ooh, these are little boomerang boys. Gimme. Oh, it's literally, it's literally a boomerang. Uh, oh, we're still, we're still swimming right now. Cool. Oh, it's, it even moves with us. Edible prey fish, high calorie count. So good for food, gives us minus seven water though. Small edible prey fish, minus three water, plus eight food. We gotta get up top, oops. Right, shift, sorry, tab. Oxygen. Yes, aware. Okay, so let's get a little bit closer to the pod. I went a little bit too far out, I think. Cause we got into, we got into like actual danger there. there there's, our, there's our little wreckage spot from earlier. Oh man, guys, this is dope. Giant coral tubes. I said, oh hey, this is this is a thing. I don't know what we can use these for. We can have these little mushroom boys. That's good. Okay, I like that. I like that. They're cute. They're horrifying too, but like, but they're cute. I suspect that'll be my feelings for, for most of this game. Horrifying but cute. Oh, can I get this this little boy? I know. Come back. Oh. It's like Pokemon so far. I don't know why I have an impulse to collect the cute little fish because they're they're just living their lives here. I shouldn't like interrupt the ecosystem, but bladderfish. Ooh, 
how does that work? A natural water filter. Interesting. So I wonder if... We probably don't, don't need this many. <laughs> like, I'm just, like, gathering them compulsively. Um, I wonder if we're going to... Oh, damn. Also, this is just a forewarning for anybody who's familiar with the game. If I miss stuff, I apologize greatly. I do not know what I'm doing. This is my first time playing, so bear with me if, I, if I'm slow to pick up on stuff or miss resources or whatever. Oh, there we go. So, oh, let's get the salvage then. That's probably going to be important for building, like, early game stuff, right? That's usually how this goes. That's salvage, right? Yes, it is. So I wonder, I wonder if, we can, if we can, like, craft with the, with the bladder fish then. Where did I go? Oh, there we go. Giant coral tubes. Oh. No. We knew that, though. Peeper. Gimme. No? Okay. It's just so cute, though. Um, is this salvage? Or is this just, just debris? Oh, hey, nice. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of salvage. Okay, so that takes up a lot of inventory space. Let's head back and, uh, oh, what's this, though? Is this glowy? Uh, we're a little low on, oh, oh, no. Oh, we need to eat food. Let's go, let's go in here and eat real quick. And see what's up. Can we, oh, boars, keep on, okay. I was like, how do we get inside? Oh, we can't craft yet, can we? Or can we? We can't, okay, here we go. Sustenance, here we go, water. Filtered water from a bladder fish, okay, cooked food. Cooked peeper, cooked bladder fish, cooked boomerang. Let's, let's cook a peeper. Um, it just 3D printed a peeper. That's, that's, that's cheating. That's cheating. Uh, tools. Air bladder, okay, it means silicone rubber. We can make pipes and floating air pumps. Okay, we're gonna want both of these. Sustenance, cured food, cured peeper. Oh, we can use salt to cure food. It keeps well. Oh, can, these, can the food like go bad? Oh God. Oh no. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's what I'm, that's what I'm looking for. I don't want to like burn through the salvage though, because if we need salvage for other stuff, let me like double check. Because right now, let me see if we have any other anything else. Anything else we might need from salvage? Because I don't want to just go like make all titanium. But it looks like so far we can't see anything in the tree that would need salvage. But we do need titanium. So if I screw up, I screw this up, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, but salvage seems like a pretty basic starter material anyway, so hopefully this makes sense. But we do we do want some pipes. This makes life a lot easier. That was the one thing I do remember doing. Was building pipes and stuff. Uh, we built one of those with a couple, like a five pipes. We're gonna want more than that though, because pipes are oh we we are we're running out of power. Oh god, okay. Hold on. Well let's let's what is this? How did I get this? Oh, that's the, that's the thing. Okay. Open storage. Oh, we only have so much storage. Oh, God. Okay, well. Um, we don't need this many mushrooms. Can we discard them? How do we... Hmm. We'll figure that out later, I guess? Or we'll just keep them forever. Um, okay. So let me... Uh, Oh, this is terrible. Oh, we need, we need to eat food. Let me uh, open up this. Let me consume. Oh, delicious. This is good for food, too, but I, I like having these other things available to us as well. Sorry. I'll get used to that, I promise. Um, cooked food. Let's cook a, a boomerang, too. Nice. Around the fins. Oh, that, 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 I, I like the, uh, the depth there of the description. 21. H2O plus three. Nice. I like that eating the fish is good. That makes me feel cut. I'm going to do that a lot. Does the power build up over time, maybe? Do we have solar power? Oh, oh underwater at night. Oh, this is so good. So I don't know how we can deploy this. 
I'm, I'm going to assume you have to hook it up to this to this somehow, right? Hmm. Let me see if I can figure this out. How do we attach the this thing? What does it say? Acts as a starting point for a pipe chain. I'm going to assume... Oh, hey, here we go. Oh, I've got to check this earlier instead of the... Oh, we need those are batteries. Perfect. Okay, so those were good to pick up, actually. Oh, shit! Sitting here planning underwater. Whoops. I don't know... How to use this. Can I just like put this in the water? Oh, it's a floating air pump. I get it now. Okay, I see. So yes, we can. Okay, okay, I like this, I like this. Let's, uh, let's just go this way. Oh, this is neat. This is neat, I like this. Wait, can we, can we oxygen here? By, by B? I thought we... Oh, there we go. We gotta be, like, right on top of it, I guess. So this pipe's like, this pipe's like, like our lifeline. While underwater. I'm gonna assume we, I'm gonna assume we want to make them as long as possible to make sure we have max pipe coverage. Although maybe they can be attacked or something. Detecting increased local radiation. Uh huh. Current is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. Like this might not be helpful at all, because like we're not that far from the surface right now. In fact, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna hazard a guess that like this is actually not helpful because we're not near the surface, and when, and when we go deeper, we're gonna wanna. We'll wanna like pop one of those up at the surface and then drag the the pipes down with us, like in that big forest area, right? We're gonna wanna like do that because like here we can just we can just swim back up. It's like less convenient, right? But it saves us the hassle. Um, we probably don't need more of those right now. I would guess. All right. I will say we are going to take this time to stop the episode here, though. I'll be back next time. And we're going to go investigate this because the Aurora is still scares me. And hopefully we find some more. We, hopefully if we don't dolphin dive. Hopefully we make some more progress with this lovely sight in the background. If you enjoyed this thing, please consider subscribing and thanks for watching. Uh, now we can find the, the channel next time. And hopefully I will see you all soon. Until next time, folks, enjoy yourselves. Get some rest. And peace out.